Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to come on here real quick and make this video, uh, but just r before that, let me just say I apologize if I like don't seem like myself or something, if I'm like laggy or spacey or you know whatever in this video. Um, if you follow me on Snapchat, you know I just have not been sleeping well. Um, I've only been getting three hours of sleep a night, and that's been since the beginning of October. I'm filming this on the 29th, I think. So uh, this whole month, <laughs> I just haven't been sleeping. Um, there's just kind of like a lot going on in my life right now, and <sighs> so I just haven't been sleeping well, stressed out, blah blah blah, whatever. Um, so I don't want to get too much into it, because that's not what this video is about. Alright, so I wanted to make this video because I wanted to answer a question that I get asked the most um, in regards to my cheek piercings or dimple piercings, whatever you want to call them. Um, and that is how to hide them. Now, I've never really had to worry about hiding them. Um, for those of you who don't know, I have a stay from girlfriend, so I don't necessarily have a job. Um, so I don't really have to worry about hiding them. But I have he heard stories and I've known people who, you know, they get theirs and they need to hide them. And they're, there's, like, no real way to hide them. Um, <laughs> I knew one girl... Like, no shade to her, but she got hers done, and then she got a job, and like, great, she got a job, but she couldn't have them at her job, so her only option, really, was to just take off the tops and just leave the bars in. And what happened was, like, I think she ended up swallowing one of the bars because it fell out while she was eating, and she ended up having to take both, uh, well, one she swallowed, but she had to take the other one out, and so she lost her um, cheek piercings, and it would really suck. So we don't want to be swallowing any bars um, or anything like that. So I was on bodycandy.com. Let, let, let me just say they did not send me this. I'm not being sponsored or anything like that. Um, I actually don't care for body candy. If I'm being really honest with you guys. Um, their prices are fairly good actually. But it's their customer service that I just don't care for. Um, they're... Every time I've emailed them about jewelry, I either never get a response or they're very rude sounding to me. Um, and I'm not like a dumb bitch. Like I'm not asking like stupid questions um, in regards to their jewelry. So they always like have just rubbed me the wrong way. So I really don't buy from them. But I was bored and just kind of browsing and I came across these and I was like, oh my gosh, like why did I not think of these before to hide the cheek piercings? Like, and now I'm sure to some of you guys, like, you may have already thought about this. Um, and if you follow me on Snapchat, you know what I'm talking about because I showed you guys in Snap. But, yeah, that is, I'm going to put them behind uh, or on top of my phone so you guys can really see them. But that is Labrat Retainers. And I believe these are Bioflex. Um, but, yeah, so I did actually wear these for, I think it was like three or four days because I wanted to see... They were comfortable, um, how well they like held up and everything like that. And I have to say, I'm actually really impressed with how they like held up and um, how well they hid the cheek piercings. Um, and I took a picture of me wearing them. I'm sorry, I'm so spacey, guys. Um, I took a picture of me wearing them, but I recently just got a new phone. So if I can get that picture from my old phone, I will actually insert it now. Alright, so I would put these in in this video, but honestly, I don't feel like taking off uh, or out my uh, jewelry right now, and I do have a no-pull disc on this one because that one's acting up, and no-pull discs always just help my cheek piercings, like, calm the fuck down. But anyway, so this is what it looks like. Obviously, this is the side that goes will be in your mouth, resting against the inside of your cheek. Now these, the tops, just pull out like that, and that's what it looks like, and you just, I can do it, and it just pushes right back in, and they fit really snug, um, or I mean the top fits really snug in the bar, so it's not loose or anything, you don't really have to worry about it being like pulled out or anything crazy like that. I actually do have my um, order information right here. Um, so I can tell you guys the gauge and the length and the price and all that stuff. Um, mine are 14 gauge and they are, the length is 5 eighths. 
which 5 8 is the same length as the bars I have in, which is the bars I got pierced with. Everyone always asks me that, when did I switch to shorter bars? I never had longer bars in. Um, please watch my other dimple piercing videos if you are new to my channel and you have questions about dimple piercings. If you're just coming across this, I don't mean to be rude, but I do get a lot of questions in regard to dimple piercings and after a while, the questions are so repetitive but I, I don't really remember a lot um, in great detail of having my dimples pierced. I've had them done for over two years now. So if you do have any questions about my dimple piercings or dimple piercings in general, please watch my dimple piercing videos before you ask me. Um, I'd really appreciate that because I'm, I'm not going to be answering questions I've already answered in all of those videos. Not to be rude. I hope you guys can understand. So yeah, the bars are the same length. I would recommend getting, you know, bars... Um, that are the same length as the one you wear, um, assuming you don't have like the long bars that stick like an inch out of your face, um, that's, you're asking for your cheek piercings to act up at that point, not to be rude, um, but yeah, I believe these were $2.99, I think they were like $1.99 each or something like that, I don't quite remember, um, but I actually <laughs> googled, um, discount codes for body candy and... I did find one that got rid of shipping, so I will leave it down below for you guys. Um, I don't actually know if it still works or not. I literally just googled like discount codes for body candy, jewelry.com. Um, yeah, but that is it. Um, I hope this video was helpful for you guys. I just thought I would sh uh, share that with you guys because I think that's a great alternative to hiding them because the um, push and top is so small that you can't really see it and for us girls to wear makeup put a little bit of makeup over it and it's really going to help conceal it even more um but yeah that's pretty much it i can't think of anything else to say i'm sorry if this video was like a little weird i so spacey but i just really wanted to get this up for you guys um to help those of you who need this video but yeah that is it um if you guys want to follow me on any of my social media you can just check down in the description box and all that stuff is there I have um, a playlist link down there that has all my piercing related videos, including my dimple videos. So go check that out if you want to know more about my piercings or my dimple piercings. But yeah, um, hopefully you guys will watch my next video.